Hey, so this video will be how to clear diagnostics in uh, Drake tech software for individual tax preparation. So I just recorded a previous video showing how to prepare tax return in Drake. And now we're clearing diagnostics, which is last step of tax preparation. So let's jump in. Uh, so here, after we prepare tax, um, tax return and we go to the calculate, it shows us e-filing status that it means that return is not ready to be e-filed and we have some diagnostics, errors, or missing information to answer. So let's start. So what I usually do, I go from here, federal, and just start answering. So like, for example, this one is telling me that um, digital assets question was not answered, like if they had something. So it takes me right away where, where the question has to be answered. So like, this question is at any time during 2022 did the taxpayer receive ta -da 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 digital assets so i would choose no and of course it depends if the taxpayer did or not did not like sell or received um uh, crypto that year so you have to ask the clients ba in, based on that question oh you know what actually this client is yes <laughs> so i'm just gonna uh, check yes or maybe no. Anyways, I need to double check, but this is how, where, you, where you check that. And then you just go back to calculate and you kind of see what other errors it tells you. So this one, for example, you can double click and see what it says. And they say, oh, you didn't include under screen IDS. We didn't include their driver license. So I go to that screen. And here, if I do have driver license, number information i enter it here if i don't i just check this box uh, that the taxpayer did not provide me with a driver license so and that's it let's look for another uh, things with, that we didn't include so this one says you failed to indicate if you had authority interest in foreign accounts so i kind of know where this question is but that link might or not might not take us where it has to be entered. So let's try. If you double click on this one, it just says that we haven't checked that, but it doesn't tell me where it is. So sometimes it's tricky like that. It's actually, but it does tell us uh, to schedule B1, proceed to screen B3, and also answer all the questions. Interesting. In the answer is no, select no on screen one. Okay. So basically we go to screen one as, as it did tell us about this. And here this part foreign accounts. If answer is no, check, check it here. So in my case, the answer is no. So I check that box and the diagnostic should be gone. All right. So this one just tells me things like I didn't enter pin number and you know, all these things. So to in order to fix that, what do we have to do? We have to do a couple of things. Uh, so in Drake, th this is section electronic filings and filing and banking. So we have to go there and choose. First of all, we have to choose, go to e-file and uh, make that tax return ready to e-file. We can also, if you file in states, we should cho choose the states in here. So this will tell the software that we want to e-file. The next step would be to go to e-signature things. So we need to cho choose the a signature date here. So I'm going to choose today's date, which is October 23. But you can choose the date that actually um, the client signs, signs the e-file authorization. Pin signature. So I usually like choose whichever I have one on file. Uh, signature for taxpayer so you can choose it yourself or the client can choose it it's up to you so that's kind of like important things to enter if your client receive identity protection pin this is a place to enter it and i think we should be good yeah here you go oh no almost <laughs> almost good uh, so let's say what it says now a state selected for e-file is not eligible. Okay, cool. But that's just, for, but I wonder what's going on with federal. So I think it wants us to clear uh, f states before we can e-file. But let me see. Maybe there is something else going on here. Not all diagnostics are listed in that field we were just looking at. Some of them are listed here under messages. Oh, no. Actually, in this case, the only thing it tells me is that if when we will fix um, states, then 
federal will be fixed as well. So let me just quickly fix states and I'll get back to this video. And so this one will take me quite some time to clear those state diagnostic diagnostics for California and New York. But after I'm done with those, that should clear my federal. So we start, so sometimes federal is not ready until states are ready or vice versa. So because it doesn't show any other electronic filing messages, errors, except this one, which says state tax returns are not eligible, it means that everything else should be okay. And here it's the same. So it's pretty much tells me that when state tax return will be ready to e-file, we well, can e-file uh, federal as well. Uh, so I'm just going to end this video on this note because that's a video how to clear federal diagnostics and state, states are getting more complicated. So I hope that was helpful and comment below if you have any questions or if you come up with any diagnostic you don't know how to clear. Maybe I do know how to. Awesome. Have a good day. Bye.